Sam, uh, Ryan Huska said this morning that you've done everything <clears throat> that has been asked of you, and yet there's still one final big test that looms. Do you sort of feel as though you've done enough? Can you, can you win or lose a job, in your own opinion, with one more game? I mean, it's now is the point where the pressure comes in, and I think you know it's the last preseason game. So uh, you know the lineup is, or the guys are pretty much said. You know there've been lots of cuts, so now we have a few guys left only. So, uh, uh, but I think you know I just came here to uh, make the team. You know that's the goal, and you know uh, I would say like I'm happy with my how I played, how many points, and the way I played, and what I did, uh, what the coaches asked me to do. But now it's just like you know it's a consistency, and you know just bring it every day to the ring, and it doesn't matter if it's practice or game. Is it business as usual ahead of uh, one final game, or is this one feel a little bit different than the others? I mean, probably probably feels the difference because because this is probably the only one uh, young guy in the lineup. So, so yeah, but uh, nothing changed for me. You know, same same minds in the game. You know, and uh, you know, get to play best, my playing the best hockey. Uh, Ryan said that uh, <clears throat> he was surprised by how good you've been and how consistent you've been to this point in the preseason. Have you surprised yourself a little bit with the level you've played at and? Uh, how you've been able to do it on a consistent basis? To be honest, yeah, uh, I was like, you know, I came in the camp with uh, with mindset, but I didn't expect that it's going this. It would take this high step, or you know, this this big thing is gonna be from it. But you know, uh, you know, now I'm want to stay humble like I was, and you know, have the, still the good mindset and uh, hard working mindset. So yeah. What's changed for you, and was there a moment where something changed? I mean, since the since the even the rookie camp, you know, uh, the Penticton tournament, you know, I took it as a, I don't want to say, uh, as a just warm up, but you know, I was more excited the main camp, you know, get on the ice with the uh, older guys, you know, and you know that's the basically the camp where the, everything starts. So, you know, and I was ready for that, and uh, yeah. Oscar did say that he, you know, for tomorrow's game, he also wanted you to have a game where you'd had a little bit of rest before. Was it good just to sort of have last night? To yeah, it was to yeah. because I was playing every <laughs> single game since Penticton started. So yeah, I've been I've been busy, but it was good to have a day off because it was also a uh, good good day. It was a game uh, basically pro, uh, we didn't skate in the morning, so kind of rest of the ice. But uh, yeah, I'm ready for tomorrow. Simon, have you like like were your parents or your friends back home like like what's their reaction to your goal or to your the fact you're still here with us? I mean, it's. We call our, with my parents. We call off every game, you know. And my dad is excited, pretty pumped about it. But no, then we have some friends that, you know, just making jokes about, you know, the goal I scored. And I went around the NHL defense and uh, goalie. So uh, it's pretty good, you know. And everyone supporting me, you know. Uh, it's pretty hard to answer to everyone because the time is different. So I try to catch up uh, after practice with them. But uh, yeah, they are really, uh, really, uh, I would say, uh, really great. I'm, I'm great that. I'm grateful for them that they're trying to help me and they're trying to like, you know, even text me after every game and stuff like that. It's just that even, you know, points are one thing. It's not necessarily about getting a points, multiple points every game. So for you, what do you have to do tomorrow in order to feel like you've done in your mind, everything. I mean, tomorrow is going to be probably the biggest test for me. You know, uh, I'm. I think the Winnipeg is going to come in the full lineup. You know, and it's going to be like almost a, a regular season game. So I got to show that uh, I can compete against those guys. You know, and play the right way and don't cheat the game and work and uh, work hard and compete. And you know, it doesn't matter if I have one point, zero points, or whatever. But it, I have to play the right way, and I think that's what the coach is looking. Yeah, you scored maybe the goal of the preseason in the NHL. And more impressively, you did it while on the penalty kill. Not a lot of 19-year-olds in the PK in this league. How much does it mean to you to have that opportunity? I mean, it's a big thing, you know. Like I said, uh, maybe it's a goal of the pre uh, preseason, but uh, you know, uh, it's nice to have a goal. But I'm not thinking about that much. But uh, just uh, like I said, uh, you know, every day is new day and uh, you know, uh, new opportunity. So yeah. It's, uh, is Marty still kind of hard on you, like he was during the summer? Now that you two are. are shaping up to maybe be playing together more? Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm happy that he was texting me after games that I play good, you know, and this kind of feedback. And I would say probably now, like today was just the first practice after maybe two weeks we had like to actually together on the ice. So it was, it was good to uh, good to be on ice with him. But yeah, yeah, I would say still, still, he's times, still like that. How many times have you watched the highlight of the goal? I mean, <laughs> it jumped, it jumped uh, on me like pretty much every time I opened any social media that day or the next day. But uh, I mean, uh, it was great to see it. And then after I, there was a moment I was watching it again and again and trying to like just analyze it or just like looking at it because then I felt happy and good for it. So yeah. 
Are we going to see the Superman again, or is that one time only? No, I was I was thinking about the Sally day ago, or actually the game day, and I was like, oh, I have one Sally in my head, but uh, I couldn't do it, so it's kind of halfway. But I have I have one Sally in my hand still. So.